All right, guys, welcome back to some more Retro Bowl. And the day that this video goes up is the day of the Super Bowl. The Bengals are playing the Rams. Absolutely crazy stuff. I'm super psyched. The Bengals have been there three times now. Hopefully they can get their first win. And I'm just, I'm super stoked. I'm really happy for the city of Cincinnati, my hometown team and stuff. So I'm hoping they can pull one out. Hopefully it's a good game. That's all I'm asking for. So in this one, we're going to be playing Baltimore in week 15. And we're going to stay on extreme difficulty. And we're going to do another challenge, kind of a reverse of what we did two weeks ago. We're going to have a one-star defense this time against a five-star offense. And then hopefully this is a shootout and another good game. So let's go ahead and get straight into it. Okay, so let's go ahead and bench our defensive players. So we have the really good five-star D lineman Reeves that we signed out of free agency a few weeks ago. And then also this decent D lineman Boston who's projected, I believe, four and a half stars. So let's go ahead and bench him and see how low our defensive rating drops to him. We're already at a one-star and we are now at a half star defense so it's not even a one star defense going up against a five star offense in baltimore on extreme difficulty it's just gonna be crazy as you can see we're still on extreme and let's go ahead and get this thing started i'm excited all righty so you guys can see we are 13 and 0 we have a half star defense now and a three star offense going against baltimore who's 10 2 and 1 with a five star offense and a five star defense on extreme difficulty and we're probably going to stay on extreme difficulty for the rest of the season and really just challenge yourself. So let's go ahead and get this one started. Okay, so we are on the road and set to kick off to get this one going and let's see what they do on the first drive. If we somehow stop them, I would lose my mind. There's no reason we should stop them at all. We have a half star defense, extreme difficulty. They should go down the field. It's gonna be an absolute shootout. I, I hope I hope we can keep up with them. And there's a touchdown already and they got the extra points. So here we go, let's go ahead and get this thing going. Okay, so just like last week, we just need to move the chains. We can't get huge plays. I mean, these defenses are really good, so let's get this started. We're not gonna start with a run. We're actually gonna start, actually we will start with a run with the quarterback. I lied, guys, I apologize. Not too bad, six yards, we'll take it. All right, so we got Riddick coming across the middle along with Rag. Let's see what we can do. Good throw, let's go. 13 yard gain, we're moving it, we're moving it. Now probably in the first quarter, we got a second left. Okay, so we got Rag on a streak, Riddick coming across, and let's see what we can do here. Man, that's going to be a good throw and 14-yard gain to end the first quarter, so we are in first and goal. Let's go ahead and get a touchdown here. All right, so I think Riddick might be open. I hope he is. The other routes are decent. We'll see. We'll see. And we might just go ahead and get Swain, and let's go. Swain out of the backfield, diving in for a touchdown, baby. All righty, let's go for two. Let's do this thing. All right, so even though we're on extreme difficulty, we still go for two, we don't mess around, and we're probably just gonna go ahead and run this in with the quarterback, and we dive it in, there we go. We got it eight, seven now, we got a little bit of a lead, I'm liking it. Okay, so they're moving it easy, they're throwing the ball all over the field, or Lamar Jackson could be running too, but I guess they like to pass it, so that maybe he's hurt or something. All right, another touchdown, they're gonna go for two since we did. All right, and they get it easy, so still up by seven. All right, we have 52 seconds to get another touchdown, hopefully take the lead before the end of the half. Okay, so we got Riddick on a little bit of an out here. We're probably just gonna have to focus on him today. And that's uh, a bad throw. That's my bad. Okay, so it's third down and 10. I really hope that Riddick can get open here. And no, that's gonna be to Swain. Let's go. That's perfect. That's perfect. All right, cool. We got a first down. Okay, so let's go ahead and we'll stay, we'll stay with this play. We got another two, three plays before we really need to get some chunk yardage. So Riddick, there we go. Let's go. All right, 14 yard gain. Probably gonna stop the clock right there. Okay, so we maybe got one or two more plays before we have to just go for a field goal. We got streaks right here. Riddick, hopefully he's open. I doubt he's going to be. And we, how did we not get sacked right there? That was clutch. Get out of bounds. Okay. I think we maybe got one more play. If we have to, we'll just throw it away. We'll throw it away if we have to. Okay, we're just throwing it away. All right, we got one second, literally one second left. We're going to try our probably the longest field goal we've ever attempted. This is 48 yards. All right, here we go. Are we gonna miss it? Oh, it doinks in, let's go! 48 yard field goal doinks in, that was clutch. So now it's 15 to 11 going in the half. Woo, okay, okay. All right, so we got the ball to start the second half and we're only down by four right here. That field goal was clutch, the two point conversion was clutch. Everything's just been pretty smooth today. Hopefully I didn't just jinx it right there. And a good throw right there and he drops the ball. What, Riddick, what are we doing? Come on, man. Okay, so it's fourth down and six. We got to get this right here. This is huge. Okay, we got Riddick on a post. <sighs> this is kind of risky for Mitch Trubisky, but we're going to test it. We're going to test it. Come on. Come on, Riddick. Let's go. No, and he fumbled. And we got it back. What? That play was insane. 
Okay, I'll take the first down, but man, that was risky for Mitch Trubisky right there. Okay, so they're sending some pressure. Hopefully, we can get Riddick in behind them, and we probably will. We will, we will. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Oh, almost a touchdown, 20-yard gain. Now we are first and goal again. Let's go, baby. All right, so we're gonna try and run this in right here. Come on, Swain. Let's go. We didn't have to dive easy, not even touch. Swain with the second touchdown today. Let's go. Okay, so our second two-point conversion. This would be huge if we get it. Let's see if we can. Swain out of the backfield, and let's go. We are up by four. Field goal doesn't even tie it, so let's see what the defense can do here. Probably not much. Okay, so they're moving the ball, and that's going to end the first quarter. So they finally run the ball, so Lamar Jackson decided to use his legs a little bit. Let's see what the fourth quarter has in store, baby. Okay, so they are throwing it. It's probably going to be another touchdown right here. And another touchdown. Are they going to go for two? And they missed the extra point, so they're only up by two right now. We, we got to take advantage of that. Okay, so we need points, but I think the strategy is is to try and run out the clock as well. We don't want to give them any time. We don't want to give them even 13 seconds because you know what Patrick Mahomes did against the Bills. I feel like on extreme difficulty, that could happen to us. And that's not a good way to start, but we will run some time off. Okay, so another post for Riddick. Man, I just I don't know if I like this at all, but... This is risky, and he catches it. Another 15-yard gain tipped. That I'm surprised we haven't had thrown an interception today. All right, so he's coming back across the middle. Can we mix these plays up a little bit? I feel like we're coming pretty predictable, and that's actually still a good play. Oh, can we score? Can we score? Okay, that's good. We didn't actually score. We can actually kick a field goal now if we have to. All right, second down. We got a post right here from Riddick. Don't make any bad decisions. Okay, there we go. All right. And I think we're gonna be able to just kick a field goal right here. Yes, we have three seconds left. Okay, so we got three seconds left. We are at the 12 yard line. We're kicking a field goal. Hopefully we can end it right here. Here we go. All right, three, two, one. That should be through the uprights. Let's go. Last second field goal, back to back weeks to win the game. Absolute clutchness. We had two field goals, a 48 yarder, and then that one from the 12 yard line to end it. I feel like the Bengals right now in the playoffs so far. They ended the game against the Titans on a last second field goal and then ended it on a field goal against the Chiefs as well. So, all righty. All righty. I'm liking the extreme difficulty in these challenges so far. And with that, we improved to 14-0. Kansas City seems like they lost another game. They dropped the 10-4 and and then Denver and Los Angeles are at the bottom right there. I mean, this is this is tough. We still got, what, three more games left in the regular season and then moves to the postseason. The extreme difficulty is no joke. I mean... These games have been absolutely insane coming down the wire. Literally, actually, the last three games, the last game of the overtime against when we did the one star offense against five star defense. And then last week's game, last second field goal. And then this week's game, it's just been absolutely super fun. I, I just I'm super glad that I'm testing my abilities on this game. And so, yes, this organization has definitely taken some criticism in the past. We've had a lot of trouble, especially last year, Gruden getting fired and we coming in and just changing the culture. Let's go ahead and praise the fans for that. They, these fans are awesome. I mean, they deserve it. They deserve every bit of it. Clap, 214 yards and a touchdown. Not too bad. Swain in there with two touchdowns. I'll take it. And then Reddick had 143 yards, no touchdowns. But Rag even got a catch in there. So, I mean, not too bad. Our kicker had a clutch game as well. I mean, that 48-yard field goal, that joint in was literally a difference in the game. And another great piece of news, our offensive lineman, Jaden Griffin, is back from his injury and he's ready to play, even though the offensive linemen don't make a huge difference in the game, but I'm not going to complain. He's back and he's he's a pretty decent four-star lineman, I believe. Okay, so let's go ahead and reactivate our defensive players. They sat out that game. They're going to be back next week. I'm not sure what sort of challenge I'm going to try and do next week, but that one made another great game, especially, like I said, on extreme difficulty. That's going to do it for this one also. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, go ahead and leave a like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in next week's Retro Bowl video.